Coming into NDT2, especially NDT2, the reception is always really easy. I mean, it's it's the system that's designed for, for new people. There's a turnover every three seasons, so it means that new dancers are always given the opportunity to, to learn and dance this rep. So, I mean, it is such a big company and such a milestone, I say. We get to do so many different styles, which is amazing. We get to do Hans van Maan, and we get to do Paul, Paul and Sol. We get to do Yuzhi Kilian. We get to do so many different kind of things. So I think it really, it's really an, a great way of learning how to be a different stage pers personality every time you do a different kind of piece. You get hired in NDT, first of all, because you have a certain talent and a physical control and technique, but also because they see a lot of growth in you in the future. In general, they always hire people who, have a, who still have a long way to go, who are not there yet, so they can still like mold. shape you and mold you and yeah. If you compare the NDT audition with other auditions, for example, we don't wear a number. Yeah. And that's, that's very different than other auditions. So we're not like products, let's say. They really look at you as an individual and they look at you as a personality and they try to discover like, hmm, what's interesting about this yeah. person. Dancing the same three pieces every night 20 times. I mean, it's difficult to keep it fresh, let's say, or, or continue to enjoy the same moments. But I think that's a good opportunity to find new things in the piece and develop it. For me, the hard time of being a dancer is to always having to push yourself. Sometimes you have days that you don't feel like, like work. Sometimes you're just really tired and you're exhausted or you just had a, a very long week or you have emotional things going on at home, but you still need to be able to make that click and go on stage and perform the best you can. We just started our Dutch tour now. We had our premiere last night. So we have 20 shows to go of the same show and I mean, we continue rehearsing during this period, so we have to learn new ballets for the next programme and the workload stays pretty much the same during the day and then we have to perform during the night, so it's, it's quite an intense period, you're with the same people the whole day. You don't get the time to wander around and to fly and to think too much about oh, who do I want to be and what kind of dancer do I want to be, no, you just have to do it. And in a way, it's nice because you get to grow further and further earlier in your in your career